A Kansas City, Kansas Mayor Joe Reardon only has a few days left in office after his shocking decision not to seek a third term. Lindsay Shively sat down with Mayor Reardon to talk about the constant change in Wyandotte County over the past eight years. It's been hard to keep pace with Wyandotte County. The Kansas Speedway kept development right on track. I think there's a lot of uncertainty as to whether was the Speedway and Nebraska Furniture Mart and Cabela's, was that the top? Not even close. Joe Reardon became mayor eight years ago and helped score a stadium and Cerner offices. Development continued east to the 39th Street corridor. And KCK hit the national stage when Google Fiber came to town. It wasn't a call where it said, you won the prize, here's the ticket, right? It was a call that said, we want to come and meet with you. But maybe it's what's happening in this neighborhood that's one of the biggest accomplishments. Arguably, a food desert now has an oasis. This is the only grocery store to be built in the county in decades. And five years later, it's thriving. There's still plenty of work to do. The EPA building sits empty downtown. And in a county considered crime ridden, even though crime rates are at a 30 year low, reputations are slow to change. I think that there still is some misperception around this, but by the way, the facts matter. After his father's 12 years as mayor, he wants to continue a reared in legacy of success. Success breeds success, develops a momentum behind it, and I think that's where we are in the city. We've got momentum. Now all eyes look to see if the incoming mayor can keep this momentum going. I was Lindsay Shively reporting here. Now, Reardon endorsed incoming Mayor Mark Holland, who will be sworn in next week. Reardon, by the way, still wouldn't tell us his next move, but says he'll announce it soon.